Hey, what's up gamers? Enforcer5150 here, and yeah, I'm doing another crash fix video on Modern Warfare 2, and I really should not have to be doing these videos and trying to find these, because Infinity Ward needs to just freaking fix these issues and get people to actually play the game. There's just so many out there that uh, I just can't find you know, for, for sure ways to actually get the game going again for some people. But uh, I, I'm just gonna go through some of these uh, new fixes, or not really new, but they're kind of both new and uh, not new. <laughs> um, all in all, um, we're gonna just start with uh, number one, which is the N NVIDIA drivers. Um, if you're using an NVIDIA graphics card, yes, there is a few ways that you can go about this and see if it works for you. One is obviously rolling back your driver as they put on their Trillo, Trillo board. Uh, you can roll back to either uh, 516.59 or 522.25. Uh, the one that has had the major problems was 526.47. And now that one I've been using and I haven't had that many problems with it. So I don't think it's actually just that. And it may be the card you're on or maybe the die that you're using in the card that you're on. But anyway, uh, you know, try to roll back to those drivers. But here is an, another one that they actually put out um, in the patch on the 4th, which was the Hotfix driver version 526.61. Now, this doesn't come with your normal um, game-ready driver. You have to actually apply it manually and go to NVIDIA's customer help website to download it. I'll put the link in the description below and I obviously on the screen here, that that ain't gonna help <laughs> but yeah it'll be in the link in the des description below so tr try to get that one installed see if it helps with the crashes that you're you're running into because that's just one of the main things with nvidia and infinity war they just have not really been clear about or have fixed because on their trailer trailer board it says that the it's a, a global known issue and it suggests that you use the older drivers but then uh their update yesterday says that you should try this new um hotfix driver so either one of those may work before i go on to the next one i do want to say you want to make sure that you fully on install your old driver everything to it use the nvidia um cleaner tool and everything just make sure everything is gone like take out uh, nvidia experience take out everything so if it's a part of the driver you'll make sure that it's completely gone so the next one here is to install c plus plus visual um now this one you definitely want to remove your old versions go into your windows program files and just remove the old uh c plus plus one of the things with that is that if you have uh any of the old versions on there it actually helps with other games so you may have problems with newer game or older games that you've played if you remove this so keep that in mind um if you really want to play modern warfare 2 because you know you may run into some issues there like i said there's uh not a huge chance that it will work but there is some reports out there that it has worked for people and i just i just want to make sure i get all the uh, crash fixes that we can do and put them into um these videos as much as i can try to get people back back into the game or into the game in the first place all right and now this one is a little bit more difficult because if you're running into like black screen while um loading up or if you're um, crashing before you actually get into the game, this will not actually work. But um, one of the things was to run at 1080p, even if you're able to run at 1440p, and I've been running at 1080p myself, uh, just to make sure that I can actually, uh, you know, get all the FPS I can out of it, and it's easier for me to upload um to youtube but you know whenever i play that i'm not when i'm not recording and stuff like that i'll make sure that i run in 1440p because i want to get the best visual quality out of it especially if i'm doing something in uh single player or something like that i'll be doing co-op with raven 420 we'll probably upload some videos of that and you'll see that those will be in 1440p because i want them to be maxed out but anyway uh trying to get it to run in 1080p before you actually load the game is not not really a thing that you'll be able to do because most of the config files are still encrypted so you can't actually go in there and you know change it um, I would suggest uh, setting your desktop to say 
1080p or 720p even just to make sure that you can get in and see if that happens or see if that helps because that may be the only way to actually do it uh, if you set your desktop to 1080p or uh, 720p. Now the last one here I found uh, just only a few reports of it. So this is one that I want you to take with a complete grain of salt and it's going to be your basically just last resort or you know <laughs> ask before you ask for a refund i guess uh if you want to spend the time but it's to try to install the game on a different hard drive uh obviously if you have only heart regular hard disks left i probably wouldn't suggest it because right now gaming on an ssd is just a way better experience than trying to run on a regular uh, mechanical hard drive because your load times are just going to be awful and i don't know how many people still have them out there i have them for storage but that's pretty much it at this point uh ssd or at least a hybrid is what i would actually use but you know moving it on to another of uh, uh, hard drive may help and like i said i only seen a few reports of this so i don't know if it's just uh total bs or if it's actually working for a lot of people because it's i'm i'm talking like three or four reports that i found and that's about it so yeah i just wanted to list some of those things you also wanted to do some of the fixes in the last videos that i've done i highly suggest you know checking those out and see if they, they work and i don't just highly suggest it because you know they're my videos <laughs> obviously i'm going to suggest them but uh it has worked for some people and there's a lot of people that it hasn't worked for but i also uh suggest uh replying in the comments in with issues that you're having because sometimes somebody might have uh, an issue and they'll be able to help you out as well uh that i'm not able to help you out with and that's you know kind of the point of youtube is just to help the community out and see if we can get everybody to play the game right now the game is not bad it is really good uh, once you're actually able to play the game i i finally hit um level 55 and you know i'm still enjoying the game just leveling up weapons there's a few things that i don't like but you know as far as the call of duty series so far this one has been pretty decent you know if we take away you know all the bugs and crashes that we've been running into it's just like i wouldn't say everybody because there's a lot of people that are actually able to to play the game anyway that is all i'm gonna do for this video i really wish i had more ways to fix this but this is kind of the uh only thing that i can do right now to try to help the community out is try to up you, update you all on everything that i find and if i find anything that might help uh i'm gonna obviously try to post it here anyway i want to thank everybody for watching this video today make sure you hit that like button definitely subscribe if you're new to the channel y'all take care and happy gaming